In the month commonly known as Movember, men are encouraged worldwide to grow mustaches to raise awareness for various men's health issues. In honor of this month, I present to you the three greatest mustaches in Toronto Maple Leaf history, starting with the most recent. During his tenure with the Toronto Maple Leafs, Mike Brown taught us three things. One, he can fight with the best of them. Two, he can sport the mustache style known as the horseshoe like none other. And three, how to groom one properly. I guess a uh, mustache tip would be uh, just keep trimming it, let it get thicker and uh, keep trimming it, but not all the way down. Second on the list belongs to one of the most decorated players in Leaf history, Wendell Clark. Clark could do it all with his physical play and of course his scoring abilities. Unfortunately, his talents on the ice seem to overshadow one of his best skill sets, the ability to grow the second best mustache in Maple Leafs history. And finally, there's Lanny McDonald, the man that revolutionized the mustache in hockey. Lanny McDonald had an illustrious career, recording 500 goals and 1,000 points while capturing one Stanley Cup championship. What's even more impressive? He achieved all this while cementing himself as the athlete with not only the greatest mustache in Leaf history, but the most famous one in all of sports. And there you have it, the three best mustaches in Toronto Maple Leaf history. With honorable mention going out to those who just missed the cut, Brian McCabe, Ian White, and of course the great Eddie Shack. From Toronto, Cody Manton, CSM Sports.